Right, I've just got a new multimeter for the workshop. Well, it's a two-in-one um, multimeter. It's a multimeter and oscilloscope. Um, I needed a new multimeter and I thought I'd get a really good one this time. So it comes in this box here and it's made by Mustol and it's the MDS8207 model. In the box you have a excellent user's manual which is written in English throughout with many diagrams and I'm quite new to electronics I only have basic electronic um, knowledge so this is really handy to have a nice user manual like this one all written in English. The actual multimeter is in this lovely canvas type bag and this is a nice quality bag with drawstrings to shut it so that protects it nicely in the workshop. On the back of the multimeter we have the um, pull out stand and the battery compartment. It takes three AA batteries and there's a special way of inserting the batteries. It must be the two outer ones before you put the um, middle one in. And that's clearly um, specified on the actual um, instructions there. And then there's a set of good quality plastic leads. I don't think they're silicone, but they're very soft plastic and very manoeuvrable. So they're good. And then there's a thermometer um, plug and wire kit. It says on the side of the actual probes that um, they're rated at 1000 volts, 10 amps. Um, I'm not sure what that means exactly or whether they're up to that. But they look like um, nice quality probes. Well, they're much better than the ones I've had on my um, previous multimeters. And this is some close-ups of the actual multimeter. A lot of people like this model because it has two off positions on the dial there. And across here we have four function menu buttons. The actual multimeter is made of a tough ABS type plastic and it's a nice heavy item. And it actually feels to be really good quality. The plugs are nice to plug in, very smooth. And it's got a nice size screen. So now I've just turned off a couple of my studio floodlights so you can see the um, screen and I'll put it in the oscilloscope screen first. And now the actual multimeter functions.
and you can scan through on function 3 until you get the speaker come up there for the bleeper So now I can test the thermometer out with the K-type plug. You have plus and minus. Minus goes to the COM. And then switch up to centigrade. And if I pinch the end of that wire, it should measure my temperature. And you can also see it in Fahrenheit as well So I think it's an excellent multimeter and oscilloscope all in one and a thermometer and I'm really pleased with it. I haven't got anything to actually check the accuracy of this tool but I've seen several people's uh, videos of the models previous to this one and that one seemed dead accurate so I would think this one is as well. And in any case it's brilliant for what I'll be using it for and my basic knowledge of electronics but hopefully with this multimeter and oscilloscope together I'll be able to learn a bit more about the subject.